Chongqing, also U.S., Chinese, T.I. Circumflex Listen, alternately romanized as Chongqing, is a major city in southwest China. Administratively, it is one of China's four municipalities under the direct administration of central government the other three are Beijing, Shanghai and Tianjin, and the only such municipality in China located far away from the coast, Chongqing was a municipality during the Republic of China administration, serving as its wartime capital during the Second Sino-Japanese War 1937 during this period, Chongqing was listed as one of the world's four anti-fascist command centers, along with Washington, D.C., London and Moscow. The current municipality was recreated on 14 March 1997 to help develop the central and western parts of China. The Chongqing Administrative Municipality has a population of over 30 million, spread over an area the size of Austria. The city of Chongqing made of nine urban districts has a much smaller population of 18,384,100 as of 2016 estimation. According to the 2010 census, Chongqing is the most populous Chinese municipality, and also the largest direct controlled municipality in China, containing 26 districts, 8 counties, and 4 autonomous counties. The official abbreviation of the city, Yu, Yu was approved by the State Council on 18 April 1997. This abbreviation is derived from the old name of a part of the Jialing River that runs through Chongqing and feeds into the Yangtze River. Chongqing has a significant history and culture. Being one of China's national central cities, it serves as the economic center of the upstream Yangtze Basin. It is a major manufacturing center and transportation hub. A July 2012 report by the Economist Intelligence Unit described it as one of China's 13 emerging megalopolises. Topic: History. Topic: Ancient history. Tradition associates Chongqing with the state of Ba. This new capital was first named Jiangzhou. Jiangzhou. Topic: <inaudible> Imperial Era. Jiangzhou subsequently remained under Qin Shi Huang's rule during the Qin Dynasty, the successor of the Qin State, and under the control of Han Dynasty emperors. Jiangzhou was subsequently renamed during the Northern and Southern Dynasties to Chu Prefecture, Chu Zhou then in 581 AD Sui Dynasty to Yu Prefecture, Yu Zhou and later in 1102 during Northern Song to Gong Prefecture. Gongzhou. The name Yu however survives to this day as an abbreviation for Chongqing, and the city center where the old town stood is also called Yuzhang Central Yu. It received its current name in 1189, after Prince Zhao Dun of the Southern Song dynasty described his crowning as king and then Emperor Guangzong as a double celebration. Simplified Chinese, Shuang Zhang Shi Qing, traditional Chinese, Shuang Zhang Shi Qing, Pinyin, Shuang Chong Shi Qing, or Chongqing in short. In his honor, Yu Prefecture was therefore renamed Chongqing Subprefecture marking the occasion of his enthronement. In 1362, Yuan Dynasty, Ming Yujun, a peasant rebel leader, established the Daxia Kingdom Dasha at Chongqing for a short time. In 1621, Ming Dynasty, another short-lived kingdom of Daliang, Daliang was established by Shi Chongming, Shi Chongming with Chongqing as its capital. In 1644, after the fall of the Ming dynasty to a rebel army, Chongqing, together with the rest of Sichuan, was captured by Zhang Xianzhang, who was said to have massacred a large number of people in Sichuan and depopulated the province, in part by causing many people to flee to safety elsewhere. 
The Manchus later conquered the province, and during the Qing dynasty, immigration to Chongqing and Sichuan took place with the support of the Qing Emperor. In 1890, the British Consulate General was opened in Chongqing. The following year, the city became the first inland commerce port open to foreigners. The French, German, U.S. and Japanese consulates were opened in Chongqing in 1896–1904. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Provisional capital of the Republic of China During and after the Second Sino-Japanese War, from November 1937 to May 1946, it was Generalissimo Chiang Kai-shek's provisional capital. After Britain, the United States, and other allies entered the war in Asia in December 1941, one of the Allies' deputy commanders of operations in Southeast Asia Southeast Asia Command SEAC, Joseph Stilwell, was based in the city. The city was also visited by Lord Louis Mountbatten, the supreme commander of SEAC which was itself headquartered in Ceylon, modern-day Sri Lanka. Chiang Kai-shek as supreme commander in China worked closely with Stilwell. The Japanese Air Force heavily bombed it. Due to its mountainous environment, many people were saved from the bombing. Due to the bravery, contributions and sacrifices made by the local people during World War II, Chongqing became known as the City of Heroes. Many factories and universities were relocated from eastern China to Chongqing during the war, transforming this city from inland port to a heavily industrialized city. In late November 1949 the nationalist KMT government fled the city. Topic. Municipality status On 14 March 1997, the Eighth National People's Congress decided to merge the sub-provincial city with the neighboring Fuling, Wanxian, and Xinjiang prefectures that it had governed on behalf of the province since September 1996. The resulting single division became Chongqing Municipality, containing 30,020,000 people in 43 former counties without intermediate political levels. The municipality became the spearhead of China's effort to develop its western regions and to coordinate the resettlement of residents from the reservoir areas of the Three Gorges Dam project. Its first official ceremony took place on the 18th of June 1997. On 8 February 2010, Chongqing became one of the four national central, core cities, the other three are Beijing, Shanghai and Tianjin. On 18 June 2010, Liangzhong New Area was established in Chongqing, which is the third state-level new areas at the time of its establishment. <laughs> Organized crime and the gang trials In the first decade of the 21st century, the city became notorious for organized crime and corruption. Gangsters oversaw businesses involving billions of yuan and the corruption reached into the law enforcement and justice systems. In 2009, city authorities under the auspices of Municipal Communist Party Secretary Bo Zilai undertook a large-scale crackdown, arresting 4,893 suspected gangsters, outlaws, and corrupt cadres, leading to optimism that the period of gangsterism was over. However, local media later highlighted the apparent reliance by the authorities on torture to extract confessions upon which convictions were based. In December 2009, one defense lawyer was controversially arrested and sentenced to 18 months in prison for coaching his client to make false claims of torture. And in July 2010, another lawyer released videotapes of his client describing the torture in detail. In 2014, four policemen involved in the interrogation were charged with the practice of opposed illegal interrogation techniques, considered by observers to be torture.
Topic: Geography. Topic: Physical geography and topography. Chongqing is situated at the transitional area between the Tibetan Plateau and the plain on the middle and lower reaches of the Yangtze River in the sub-tropical climate zone often swept by moist monsoons. It often rains at night in late spring and early summer, and thus the city is famous for its night rain in the Ba Mountains. As described by poems throughout Chinese history including the famous written on a rainy night A Letter to the North by Li Shangyin. The municipality reaches a maximum width of 470 kilometers, 290 miles from east to west and a maximum length of 450 kilometers, 280 miles from north to south. It borders the following provinces, Hubei in the east, Hunan in the southeast, Guizhou in the south, Sichuan in the west and northwest, and Shaanxi to the north in its northeast corner. Chongqing covers a large area crisscrossed by rivers and mountains. The Daba Mountains stand in the north, the Wu Mountains in the east, the Wuling Mountains in the southeast, and the Dalu Mountains in the south. The whole area slopes down from north and south towards the Yangtze River Valley, with sharp rises and falls. The area is featured by a large geological massif, of mountains and hills, with large sloping areas at different heights. Typical karst landscape is common in this area, and stone forests, numerous collections of peaks, limestone caves and valleys can be found in many places. The Longshuixia Gap, Longshuixia de Feng with its natural arch bridges, has made the region a popular tourist attraction. The Yangtze River runs through the whole area from west to east, covering a course of 665 kilometers (413 miles), cutting through the Wu Mountains at three places and forming the well-known three gorges: the Qutang, the Wuxia, and the Xiling Gorges. Coming from northwest and running through the Jialing Lesser Three Gorges of Libby, Wentang and Guanyin, the Jialing River joins the Yangtze in Chongqing, the central urban area of Chongqing, or Chongqing proper, is a city of unique features. Built on mountains and partially surrounded by the Yangtze and Jialing Rivers, it is known as a mountain city and a city on rivers. The night scene of the city is very illuminated, with millions of lights and their reflection on the rivers. With its special topographical features, Chongqing has the unique scenery of mountains, rivers, forests, springs, waterfalls, gorges, and caves. Li Bai, a famous poet of the Tang dynasty, was inspired by the natural scenery and wrote this epigram. Specifically, the central urban area is located on a huge folding area. Yuzhong District, Nan'an District, Shapingba District and Zhangbei District are located right on a big syncline. And the Southern Mountain of Chongqing, Tongla Mountain, along with the Zhongliang Mountain are two anticlines next to the syncline of downtown. Topic. Climate All climatic data listed below comes from the central parts of the city. Annual average 18.39 degrees Celsius 65.1 degrees Fahrenheit January average 7.9 degrees Celsius 46.2 degrees Fahrenheit July and August average 28.3 degrees Celsius 82.9 degrees Fahrenheit Historical temperature range from -1.8 degrees Celsius 29 degrees Fahrenheit on the 15th of December 1975 to 43.0 degrees Celsius 109 degrees Fahrenheit on the 15th of August 2006 Total annual hours of sunshine 955 Annual precipitation 
1,108 mm in Chongqing has a humid subtropical climate Copen CFA, bordering on a monsoonal humid subtropical climate Copen CWA, and for most of the year experiences very high relative humidity, with all months above 75%. Known as one of the three furnaces of the Yangtze River, along with Wuhan and Nanjing, its summers are long and among the hottest and most humid in China, with highs of 33 to 34 degrees Celsius (91 to 93 degrees Fahrenheit) in July and August in the urban area. Winters are short and somewhat mild, but damp and overcast. The city's location in the Sichuan Basin causes it to have one of the lowest annual sunshine totals nationally, at only 1,055 hours, lower than much of northern Europe. The monthly percent possible sunshine in the city proper ranges from a mere 8% in December and January to 48% in August. Extremes since 1951 have ranged from minus 1.8 degrees Celsius (29 degrees Fahrenheit) on the 15th of December 1975, unofficial record of minus 2.5 degrees Celsius (27 degrees Fahrenheit) was set on the 8th of February 1943 to 43.0 degrees Celsius (109 degrees Fahrenheit) on the 15th of August 2006, unofficial record of 44. O degrees Celsius, 111 degrees Fahrenheit, was set on 8 and the 9th of August 1933, as exemplified by Yuyang County below. Conditions are often cooler in the southeast part of the municipality due to the higher elevations there. Topic: Air. Chongqing, with over 100 days of fog per year, is known as the fog city, Wudo like San Francisco, and a thick layer of fog shrouds it for 68 days per year during the spring and autumn. During the Second Sino-Japanese War, this special weather possibly played a role in protecting the city from being overrun by the Imperial Japanese Army. Topic. Administrative divisions Chongqing is the largest of the four direct controlled municipalities of the People's Republic of China. The municipality is divided into 38 subdivisions three were abolished in 1997, and Wancheng and Shuangchou districts were abolished in October 2011, consisting of 26 districts, 8 counties, and 4 autonomous counties. The boundaries of Chongqing municipality reach much farther into the city's hinterland than the boundaries of the other three provincial-level municipalities Beijing, Shanghai and Tianjin, and much of its administrative area, which spans over 80,000 square kilometers 30,900 square miles, is rural. At the end of year 2017, the total population is 30.75 million. One. Topic. Urban areas A indicates with which district the division was associated below prior to the merging of Chongqing, Fuling, Wanxian, now Wanzhou, and Xinjiang in 1997. Topic. Central Chongqing Topic. Districts The urban area of Chongqing is known as Central Chongqing Chongqing spanning approximately 5,473 square kilometers 2,113 square miles, it includes the following nine districts Yuzhong District, Yuzhong Ku or Central Chongqing District the central and most densely populated district, where government and international business offices and the city's best shopping are located in the district's Jiefengbei CBD area. Yuzhong is located on the peninsula surrounded by Yiling Hill, Yangtze River and Jialing River. 
Jiangbei District, Jiangbei Ku or River North District, located to the north of Jialing River. Shapingba District, Sha Ping Ba Ku, roughly located between Jialing River and Zhongliang Mountain. Julongpo District, Julongpo Ku, roughly located between Yangtze River and Zhongliang Mountain. Nanan District, Nanan Ku or Southern Bank District, located on the south side of Yangtze River. Daduko District, Dadu Ko Ku Banan District, Ba Nan Ku or Southern Chongqing District, previously called Ba County, and changed to the current name in 1994. Its northern area merged into central Chongqing, and its capital town Yudong is a satellite city of central Chongqing. Yubei District, Yubei Ku or Northern Chongqing District previously called Zhongbei County, and changed into the current name in 1994. Its southern area merged into central Chongqing, and the capital town Lianglu Town is a satellite city of central Chongqing. Beibei District, Beibei Ku a satellite city northwest of central Chongqing. Landforms. Central Chongqing is in the eastern edge of Sichuan Basin. Yangtze River meets its major tributary stream, Jialing River, in central Chongqing. The city is located on a big syncline valley. Two tributary ranges of Huaying Mountain, Zhongling Mountain and Tongla Mountain roughly forms the eastern and western boundaries of central Chongqing. The highest point in downtown is the top of Yiling Hill, which is a smaller syncline hill that keeps Yangtze River and Jialing River apart for some more kilometers. The elevation of Yiling Hill is 379 meters (1,243 feet). The lowest point in central Chongqing is Cheoshan Gate, where the two rivers merge with each other. The altitude there is 160 meters (520 feet). The average height of central Chongqing is 259 meters 850 feet. In the near suburban Chongqing, however, there are several high mountains. The highest one is called Wugong Ling Mountain, with the altitude of 1,709.4 meters 5,608 feet. Topic. Bridges. With many bridges on Yangtze River and Jialing River in urban area, central Chongqing is sometimes called the bridge capital of China. The first major bridge built in urban Chongqing is the new Jiaotuo Jialing River Bridge built in 1958. The first bridge on Yangtze River is the Shibanpo Yangtze River Bridge or Chongqing Yangtze River Bridge built in 1977. Until 2014, within the range of central Chongqing, there are 20 bridges on Yangtze River and 28 bridges on Jialing River. Bridges in Chongqing have various structures and shapes, making Chongqing a museum of bridges. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Aerial Tramway Chongqing is the only Chinese city that keeps public aerial tramways. Historically there were three aerial tramways in Chongqing, the Yangtze River Tramway, the Jialing River Tramway and the South Mountain Tramway. Currently, only Yangtze River Tramway is still operating and it is Class 4A tourist attractions in China. This tramway is 1,160 meters (3,810 feet) long, connecting the southern and northern banks of Yangtze River. The daily passenger volume is about 10,000. <laughs> Topic: Demographics. According to a July 2010 article from the official Xinhua News Agency, the municipality has a population of 32.8 million, including 23.3 million farmers. 
Among them, 8.4 million farmers have become migrant workers, including 3.9 million working and living in urban areas of Chongqing. The metropolitan area encompassing the central urban area was estimated by the OECD Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development to have, as of 2010, a population of 17 million. This would mean that the locally registered farmers who work in other jurisdictions number 4.5 million, reducing the local, year-round population of Chongqing in 2010 to 28.3 million, plus those who are registered in other jurisdictions but live and work in Chongqing. According to China's 2005 Statistical Yearbook, of a total population of 30.55 million, those with residents registered in other jurisdictions but residing in the Chongqing enumeration area numbered 1.4 million, including 46,000 who resided in Chongqing for less than half year. An additional 83,000 had registered in Chongqing, but not yet settled there. The 2005 Statistical Yearbook also lists 15.22 million (49.82%) males and 15.33 million (50.18%) females. In terms of age distribution, in 2004, of the 30.55 million total population, 6.4 million (20.88%) were age. 0 to 14, 20.7 million, 67.69% were 15 to 64, and 3.5 million, 11.46% were 65 and over. Of a total 10,470,000 households, 2004, 1,360,000 consisted of one person, 2,940,000 two person, 3,190,000 three person, 1,700,000 90,000 four person, 783,000 five person, 270,000 six person, 89,000 seven person, 28,000 eight person, 6,000 nine person, and 10,000 households of 10 or more persons per household. Topic: Politics. Chongqing has been, since 1997, a direct controlled municipality in the Chinese administrative structure, making it a provincial level division with commensurate political importance. The municipality's top leader is the secretary of the Municipal Committee of the Communist Party of China, Party Chief, which, since 2007, has also held a seat on the Politburo of the Communist Party of China, the country's second highest governing council. Under the Soviet-inspired nomenclatura system of appointments, individuals are appointed to the position by the central leadership of the Communist Party, and bestowed to an official based on seniority and adherence to party orthodoxy, usually given to an individual with prior regional experience elsewhere in China and nearly never a native of Chongqing. Notable individuals who have held the municipal party secretary position include He Guozhang, Wang Yang, Bo Zilai, Zhang Dezhang, and Sun Zhengke. The latter three were Politburo members during their term as party chief. The party chief heads the Municipal Party Standing Committee, the de facto top governing council of the municipality. The standing committee is typically composed of 13 individuals which includes the party chiefs of important subdivisions and other leading figures in the local party and government organization, as well as one military representative. The Municipal People's Government serves as the day-to-day -day administrative authority, and is headed by the mayor, who is assisted by numerous vice mayors and mayoral assistants. Each vice mayor is given jurisdiction over specific municipal departments. The mayor is the second highest ranking official in the municipality. The mayor usually represents the city when foreign guests visit. The municipality also has a People's Congress, theoretically elected by lower level People's Congresses. The People's Congress nominally appoints the mayor and approves the nominations of other government officials. The People's Congress, like those of other provincial jurisdictions, is generally seen as a symbolic body. 
It convenes in full once a year to approve party-sponsored resolutions and local regulations and duly confirm party-approved appointments. On occasion the People's Congress can be venues of discussion on municipal issues, although this is dependent on the actions of individual delegates. The Municipal People's Congress is headed by a former municipal official, usually in their late 50s or 60s, with a lengthy prior political career in Chongqing. The Municipal Political Consultative Conference meets at around the same time as the People's Congress. Its role is to advise on political issues. The Zhengxie is headed by a leader who is typically a former municipal or regional official with a lengthy career in the party and government bureaucracy. Topic: Military. Chongqing was the wartime capital of China during the Second Sino-Japanese War i.e., World War II, and from 1938 to 1946, the seat of administration for the Republic of China's government before its departure to Nanjing and then Taiwan. It also contains a military museum named after the Chinese Korean War hero Chu Xiaoyun. Chongqing used to be the headquarters of the 13th Group Army of the People's Liberation Army, one of the two group armies that formerly comprise the Chengdu Military Region, which in 2016 was reorganized into the Western Theater Command. Topic: Economy. Chongqing was separated from Sichuan Province and made into a municipality in its own right in the 14th of March 1997 in order to accelerate its development and subsequently China's relatively poorer western areas. See China Western Development Strategy. An important industrial area in western China, Chongqing is also rapidly urbanizing. For instance, statistics suggest that new construction added approximately 137,000 square meters, 1,470,000 square feet daily of usable floor space to satisfy demands for residential, commercial and factory space. In addition, more than 1,300 people moved into the city daily, adding almost 100 million yuan, 15 million United States dollars to the local economy. Traditionally, due to its geographical remoteness, Chongqing and neighboring Sichuan have been important military bases in weapons research and development. Chongqing's industries have now diversified but unlike eastern China, its export sector is small due to its inland location. Instead, factories producing local-oriented consumer goods such as processed food, cars, chemicals, textiles, machinery and electronics are common. Chongqing is China's third largest center for motor vehicle production and the largest for motorcycles. In 2007, it had an annual output capacity of 1 million cars and 8.6 million motorcycles. Leading makers of cars and motor bikes includes China's fourth biggest automaker, Chang'an Automotive Corp and Lifen Hongda Enterprise, as well as Ford Motor Company, with the U.S. car giant having three plants in Chongqing. The municipality is also one of the nine largest iron and steel centers in China and one of the three major aluminium producers. Important manufacturers include Chongqing Iron and Steel Company and South West Aluminium which is Asia's largest aluminium plant. Agriculture remains significant. Rice and fruits, especially oranges, are the area's main produce. Natural resources are also abundant with large deposits of coal, natural gas, and more than 40 kinds of minerals such as strontium and manganese. Coal reserves approximately equals 4.8 billion tons. Xuandong Natural Gas Field is China's largest inland gas field with deposits of around 270 billion cubic meters more than one-fifth of China's total. Has China's largest reserve of strontium China has the world's second biggest strontium deposit. 
Manganese is mined in the Shushan area, although the mining sector has been criticized for being wasteful, heavily polluting and unsafe. Chongqing is also planned to be the site of a 10 million ton capacity refinery operated by CNPC parent company of PetroChina to process imported crude oil from the Sino-Burma pipelines. The pipeline itself, though not yet finished, will eventually run from Sitwe in Myanmar's western coast through Kunming in Yunnan before reaching Chongqing and it will provide China with fuels sourced from Myanmar, the Middle East and Africa. Recently, there has been a drive to move up the value chain by shifting towards high technology and knowledge-intensive industries resulting in new development zones such as the Chongqing New North Zone CNNZ. Chongqing's local government is hoping through the promotion of favorable economic policies for the electronics and information technology sectors, that it can create a 400 billion RMB high technology manufacturing hub which will surpass its car industry and account for 25% of its exports. The city has also invested heavily in infrastructure to attract investment. The network of roads and railways connecting Chongqing to the rest of China has been expanded and upgraded reducing logistical costs. Furthermore, the nearby Three Gorges Dam which is the world's largest, will not only supply Chongqing with power once completed but also allows oceangoing ships to reach Chongqing's Yangtze River port. These infrastructure improvements have led to the arrivals of numerous foreign direct investors FDI in industries ranging from car to finance and retailing, such as Ford, Mazda, HSBC, Standard Chartered Bank, Citibank, Deutsche Bank, ANZ Bank, Scotiabank, Walmart, Metro AG and Carrefour, among other multinational corporations. Chongqing's nominal GDP in 2011 reached 1,001.1 billion yuan, 158.9 billion United States dollars, while registering an annual growth of 16.4%. However, its overall economic performance is still lagging behind eastern coastal cities such as Shanghai. For instance, its per capita GDP was 22,909 yuan, 3,301 United States dollars, which is below the national average. Nevertheless, there is a massive government support to transform Chongqing into the region's economic, trade, and financial center and use the municipality as a platform to open up the country's western interior to further development. Chongqing has been identified by the Economist Intelligence Unit in the November 2010 Access China White Paper as a member of the Champs Chongqing, Hefei, Anshan, Manchin, Pingdingshan, and Shenyang, an economic profile of the top 20 emerging cities in China. Topic economic and technological development zones The city includes a number of economic and technological development zones Chongqing Chemical Industrial Park Chongqing Economic and Technological Development Zone Chongqing High Tech Industry Development Zone Chongqing New North Zone CNNZ, Chongqing Export Processing Zone Jianchao Industrial Park located in Daduko District Liangjiang New Area Liangjiang Cloud Computing Center, the largest of its kind in China, Chongqing itself is part of the West Triangle Economic Zone, along with Chengdu and Xi'an. Topic: Transport. Since its elevation to national level municipality in 1997, the city has dramatically expanded its transportation infrastructure. With the construction of railways and expressways to the east and southeast, Chongqing is a major transportation hub in southwestern China. As of October 2014, the municipality had 31 bridges across the Yangtze River including over a dozen in the city's urban core. Aside from the city's first two Yangtze River bridges, which were built, respectively, in 1960 and 1977, all of the other bridges were completed since 1995. Topic. River port 
Chongqing is one of the most important inland ports in China. There are numerous luxury cruise ships that terminate at Chongqing, cruising downstream along the Yangtze River to Yichang, Wuhan, Nanjing or even Shanghai. In the recent past, this provided virtually the only transportation option along the river. However, improved rail, expressways and air travel have seen this ferry traffic reduced or cancelled altogether. Most of the river ferry traffic consists of leisure cruises for tourists rather than local needs. Improved access by larger cargo vessels has been made due to the construction of the Three Gorges Dam. This allows bulk transport of goods along the Yangtze River. Coal, raw minerals and containerized goods provide the majority of traffic plying this section of the river. Several port handling facilities exist throughout the city, including many impromptu river bank sites. Topic Railways Major train stations in Chongqing Chongqing Railway Station in Yuzhong, accessible via Metro Lines 1 and 3 Lianglico Metro Station, is the city's oldest railway station and located near the city center. The station handles mostly long-distance trains. There are plans for a major renovation and overhaul of this station, thus many services have been transferred to Chongqing North Railway Station. Chongqing North Railway Station is a station handling many long-distance services and high-speed rail services to Chengdu, Beijing and other cities. It was completed in 2006 and is connected to Metro Line Chongqing West Railway Station as in Shapingba, a station handling many long-distance services and high-speed rail services to many cities. It is completed in 2018 Shapingba Railway Station as in Shapingba, near Shapingba CBD, accessible via Metro Line 1. It handles many local and regional train services. It is completed in 2018. Chongqing is a major freight destination for rail with continued development with improved handling facilities. Due to subsidies and incentives, the relocation and construction of many factories in Chongqing has seen a huge increase in rail traffic. Chongqing is a major rail hub regionally. Chengdu Chongqing Railway to Chengdu Sichuan Guizhou Railway to Guiyang, Xiangyang Chongqing Railway to Hubei, Chongqing Waihua Railway to Hunan, Chongqing Suining Railway, Sichuan Province, Chongqing Lichuan Railway to Hubei, Chongqing Lanzhou Railway, Gansu Railway. Topic: Highways. <laughs> 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 Traditionally, the road network in Chongqing has been narrow, winding and limited to smaller vehicles because of the natural terrain, large rivers and the huge population demands on the area, especially in the Yuzhong district. In other places, such as Zhangbei, large areas of homes and buildings have recently been cleared to improve the road network and create better urban planning. This has seen many tunnels and large bridges needing to be built across the city. Construction of many expressways have connected Chongqing to neighboring provinces. Several ring roads have also been constructed. The natural mountainous terrain that Chongqing is built on makes many road projects difficult to construct, including for example some of the world's highest road bridges. Unlike many other Chinese cities, it is rare for motorbikes, electric scooters or bicycles to be seen on Chongqing roads. This is due to the extremely hilly and mountainous nature of Chongqing's roads and streets. However, despite this, Chongqing is a large manufacturing center for these types of vehicles. Chongqing Chengdu Expressway Chongqing Chengdu Second Expressway under construction Chongqing Wanzhou Yichang Highway Wanzhou Yichang section under construction Chongqing Guiyang Highway Chongqing Changsha Expressway, Shushan Changsha section under construction. Chongqing Dazhou Xia Highway, Dazhou Xian section under construction. Chongqing Suining Expressway. 
Chongqing Nanchang Expressway, China National Highway 210, China National Highway 212. Topic: Airports. The major airport of Chongqing is Chongqing Zhongbei International Airport IATA, CKG, ICAO, ZUC. It is located in Yubei District. The airport offers a growing network of direct flights to China, Southeast Asia, the Middle East, North America, and Europe. It is located 21 kilometers 13 miles north of the city center of Chongqing and serves as an important aviation hub for southwestern China. Zhongbei Airport is a hub for China Southern Airlines, Chongqing Airlines, Sichuan Airlines, China Express Airlines, Shandong Airlines and Hainan Airlines's New China West Air. Chongqing also is a focus city of Air China, therefore it is very well connected with Star Alliance and Skyteam's international network. The airport currently has three parallel runways in operation. It serves domestic routes to most other Chinese cities, as well as international routes to Auckland, New York City, London, Los Angeles, Moscow, Doha, Dubai, Seoul, Bangkok, Phuket, Osaka, Singapore, Chiang Mai, Phnom Penh, Siem Reap, Malay, Bali, Tokyo, Kuala Lumpur, Batam, Rome and Helsinki. Chongqing Airport is also a 72-hour transit visa-free airport for foreigners in many countries Austria, Belgium, the Czech Republic, Denmark, Estonia, Finland, France, Germany, Greece, Hungary, Iceland, Italy, Latvia, Lithuania, Luxembourg, Malta, the Netherlands, Poland, Portugal, Slovakia, Slovenia, Spain, Sweden, Switzerland, Russia, the United Kingdom, Ireland, Cyprus, Bulgaria, Bulgaria, Romania, Ukraine, Serbia, Croatia, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Republic of Montenegro, Macedonia, Albania, United States, Canada, Brazil, Mexico, Argentina, Chile, Australia, New Zealand, South Korea, Japan, Singapore, Brunei, the United Arab Emirates, Qatar. Currently, Zhongbei Airport has three terminals. Terminal 1 is the oldest original terminal and is no longer in use. Terminal 2 is a larger building split into halls A and B serving domestic flights. The first, second and third phase of the airport came into operation in January 1990, December 2004, and December 2010 respectively. This domestic terminal is capable of handling 30 million passengers while its international terminal is able to handle more than 1 million passengers annually. Terminal 3A together with the third runway began operations on August 29, 2017. A fourth terminal and runway are planned to start construction in 2019. Chongqing Airport was the 10th busiest airport nationwide in 2010 measured by passenger traffic, handling 15,802,334 people. By 2015 this number doubled to more than 30 million passengers annually. The airport was also the 11th busiest airport by cargo traffic and by traffic movements in China. During the first half of year 2011, Chongqing Airport handled 8.87 million passengers, and surpassed Hangzhou Zhaoshan International Airport 8 .48 million to become the ninth busiest airport in terms of passenger traffic in mainland China. Freight development has increased, especially in the export of high value electronics, such as laptop computers. It is envisaged that Chongqing can become the global leading exporter of these products by air, signs of this potential rise being the addition of cargo routes to Frankfurt, Sydney, Chicago, and New York City. Chongqing Airport has metro access CRT Line 3 and Line 10 to its central city, and two runways in normal use. There are two other airports in Chongqing Municipality, Qinjiang Wulingshan Airport IATA, JIQ, I CAO, ZUQJ, and Wanzhou Wuxiao Airport IATA, WXN, ICAO, ZUWX. 
They are both Class 4C airports and serve passenger flights to some domestic destinations including Beijing, Shanghai and Kunming. Two more airports are being constructed soon, Wulong Xianishan Airport and Wushan Shenufeng Airport. Topic. Public transit Public transport in Chongqing consists of metro, intercity railway, a ubiquitous bus system and the world's largest monorail network. According to the Chongqing Municipal Government's ambitious plan in May 2007, Chongqing is investing 150 billion RMB over 13 years to finish a system that combines underground metro lines with heavy monorail called light rail in China. As of 2017, four metro lines, the 14 kilometers (8.7 miles) long CRT Line 1, a conventional subway, and the 19 kilometers (12 miles) long heavy monorail CRT Line 2 through Phase 2, Line 3, a heavy monorail connects the airport and the southern part of downtown. Line 6 runs between Beibei, a commuter city in the far north, to the center. Line 5 opened in late 2017. By 2020 CRT will consist of six straight lines and one circular line resulting in 363.5 kilometres of road and railway to the existing transportation infrastructure and 93 new train stations will be added to the 111 stations that are already in place. By 2050, Chongqing will have as many as 18 lines planned to be in operation. Topic Culture Topic Language The language native to Chongqing is Southwestern Mandarin. More precisely, the great majority of the municipality, save for Shushan, speak Sichuanese, including the primary Chengdu Chongqing dialect and Minjiang dialect spoken in Zhangjin and Qijiang. There are also a few speakers of Shang and Hakka in the municipality, due to the great immigration wave to the Sichuan region during the Ming and Qing dynasties. In addition, in parts of southeastern Chongqing, the Miao and Tujia languages are also used by some Miao and Tujia people. Topic: Tourism. As the provisional capital of China for almost 10 years, 1937 to 1945, the city was also known as one of the three headquarters of the Allies during World War II, as well as being a strategic center of many other wars throughout China's history. Chongqing has many historic wartime buildings or sites, some of which have since been destroyed. These sites include the People's Liberation Monument, located in the center of Chongqing City. It used to be the highest building in the area, but is now surrounded and dwarfed by numerous shopping centers. Originally named the Monument for the Victory over Axis Armies, it is the only building in China for that purpose. Today, the monument serves as a symbol for the city. The General Joseph W. Stilwell Museum, dedicated to General Vinegar Joe Stilwell, a World War II general, the Air Force Cemetery in the Nanshan area, in memory of those Air Force personnel killed during the Second Sino-Japanese War (1937–1945), and the Red Rock Village Museum, a diplomatic site for the Communist Party in Chongqing, led by Zhou Enlai during World War II, and Gaiyuan Kashia Garden, where Mao Zedong signed the Double Ten, the 10th of October, peace agreement with the Kuomintang in 1945. The Baihiliang Underwater Museum, China's first underwater museum. The Memorial of Great Tunnel Massacre, a former air raid shelter where a major massacre occurred during World War II. The Great Hall of the People in Chongqing is based on the Great Hall of the People in Beijing. 
This is one of the largest public assembly buildings in China which, though built in modern times, emulates traditional architectural styles. It is adjacent to the densely populated and hilly central district, with narrow streets and pedestrian-only walkways. The large domed Three Gorges Museum presents the history, culture, and environment of the Three Gorges area and Chongqing. Chongqing Science and Technology Museum has an IMAX theater. Luohan Si, a Ming Dynasty temple. Wangguan Escalator, the second longest escalator in Asia. Former sites for embassies of major countries during the 1940s. As the capital at that time, Chongqing had many residential and other buildings for these officials. Wuxi County, noted as a major tourism area of Chongqing. The Dazu rock carvings, in Dazu County, are a series of Chinese religious sculptures and carvings, dating back as far as the 7th century AD, depicting and influenced by Buddhist, Confucian and Taoist beliefs. Listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, the Dazu rock carvings are made up of 75 protected sites containing some 50,000 statues, with over 100,000 Chinese characters forming inscriptions and epigraphs. The Three Natural Bridges and Farong Cave in Wulong Karst National Geology Park, Wulong County are listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site as part of the South China Karst. Sikiko is a 1,000-year-old town in the Shapingba district of Chongqing. It is also known as Little Chongqing. The town, located next to the lower reaches of the Jialing River, was at one time an important source of China ware and used to be a busy commercial dock during the Ming and Qing dynasties. Fishing town or fishing city, also called the Oriental Mecca, and the place that broke God's whip is one of the three great ancient battlefields of China. It is noted for its resistance to the Mongol armies during the Southern Song Dynasty (1127–1279) and the location where the Mongol leader Monk Khan died in 1259. Shuiyu Cave in Fengdu County is the only example of a pure white jade-like karst cave in China. Fengdu Ghost City in Fengdu County is the gate of the hell in traditional Chinese literature and culture. Snowy Jade Cave, see Shuiyu Cave above. Baidi Cheng, a peninsula in Yangtze River, known due to a famous poem by Li Bai. The Chongqing Zoo, a zoo that exhibits many rare species including the giant panda, the extremely rare South China tiger, and the African elephant. Chongqing Amusement Park Chongqing Grand Theatre, a performing arts centre Foreigner's Street is an amusement park, including the Porcelain Palace, the world's largest toilet. Also the location of the abortive Love Land development in 2009 The Black Mountain Valley Media. The Chongqing People's Broadcast Station is Chongqing's largest radio station. The only municipal-level TV network is Chongqing TV, claimed to be the fourth-largest television station in China. Chongqing TV broadcasts many local-oriented channels, and can be viewed on many TV sets throughout China. The Chongqing Daily is the largest newspaper group, controlling more than 10 newspapers and one news website. Topic. Cuisine Chongqing food is part of Sichuan cuisine. Chongqing is known for its spicy food. Its food is normally considered numbing because of the use of Sichuan pepper, also known as Sichuan peppercorn, containing hydroxy alpha sanchul. Chongqing's city center has many restaurants and food stalls where meals often cost less than RMB 10. 
Local specialties here include dumplings and pickled vegetables and, different from many other Chinese cuisines, Chongqing dishes are suitable for the solo diner as they are often served in small individual-sized portions. Among the delicacies and local specialties are these dishes Chongqing hot pot, Chongqing's local culinary specialty which was originally from the northern China. Tables in hot pot restaurants usually have a central vat, or pot, where food ordered by the customers is boiled in a spicy broth. As well as beef, pork, lotus and other vegetables, items such as pig's kidney, brain, duck's bowels and cow's stomach are often consumed. Chongqing xiao mian, a common lamian noodle dish tossed with chili oil and rich mixtures of spices and ingredients. Zhongtuan fish, since Chongqing is located along Jialing River, visitors have a good opportunity to sample varieties of aquatic products. Among them, is a fish local to the region, Zhongtuan fish, Hypophthalmathus nobilis although more commonly known as bighead carp. The fish is often served steamed or baked. Pork leg cooked with rock candy, a common household dish of the Chongqing people, the finished dish, known as red in color and tender in taste, has been described as having strong and sweet aftertaste. Qianzhong skimmed soy bean cream Qianzhong is the cream skimmed from soybean milk. In order to create, this several steps must be followed very carefully. First, soybeans are soaked in water, ground, strained, boiled, restrained several times and spread over gauze until delicate, snow-white cream is formed. The paste can also be hardened, cut into slivers and seasoned with sesame oil, garlic and chili oil. Another variation is to bake the cream and fry it with bacon, which is described as soft and sweet. Quanchui chicken, spring water chicken Quanchui chicken is cooked with the natural spring water in the southern mountain of Chongqing. <laughs> Sports and recreation <laughs> Association football Professional association football teams in Chongqing include Chongqing Lifen Chinese Super League, Chongqing FC. Fald Chongqing Lifen is a professional Chinese football club who currently plays in the Chinese Super League. They are owned by the Chongqing-based Lifen Group, which manufactures motorcycles, cars, and spare parts. Originally called Qianwei Vanguard Wuhan, the club formed in 1995 to take part in the recently developed, fully professional Chinese football league system. They would quickly rise to top tier of the system and experience their greatest achievement in winning the 2000 Chinese FA Cup, and coming in fourth within the league. However, since then they have struggled to replicate the same success, and have twice been relegated from the top tier. Chongqing FC was an association football club located in the city, and competed in China League One, the country's second tier football division, before being relegated to the China League Two, and dissolving due to a resultant lack of funds. Chongqing is also the birthplace of soccer games in southwestern China. Soccer was introduced to this region in as early as 1905 by some British soldiers and missionaries. They founded a varsity soccer team at the predecessor of modern-day Guangyi High School also known as Chongqing No. 5 High School, and trained them to be a highly skilled team. A professional soccer stadium was constructed on the Guangyi campus in the Southern Mountain. It was the first professional soccer stadium in southwestern China. The Guangyi varsity team beat English and French naval teams and even the Sheffield Wednesday team in friendlies. Basketball <inaudible> 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 Chongqing Soaring Dragons became the 20th team playing in Chinese Basketball Association in 2013. They play at Dadianwen Arena, in the same sporting complex as Dadianwen Stadium.
Topic: Sport venues. Sport venues in Chongqing include The Chongqing Olympic Sports Center is a multipurpose stadium. It is currently used mostly for football matches, as it has a grass surface, and can hold 58,680. It was built in 2002 and was one of main venues for the 2004 AFC Asian Cup. Yonghe Stadium is a multi-use stadium that is currently used mostly for football matches. The stadium holds 32,000 people, and is the home of Chongqing Lifen in the Chinese Super League. The stadium was purchased by the Lifen Group in 2001 for RMB 80 million and immediately replaced Dadianwen Stadium as the home of Chongqing Lifen. Dadianwen Stadium is a multipurpose stadium that is currently used mostly for football matches. The stadium has a capacity 32,000 people, and up until 2001 was the home of Chongqing Lifen. Religion The predominant religions in Chongqing are Chinese folk religions, Taoist traditions and Chinese Buddhism. According to surveys conducted in 2007 and 2009, 26.63% of the population believes and is involved in cults of ancestors, while 1.05% of the population identifies as Christian. The reports didn't give figures for other types of religion. 72.32% of the population may be either irreligious or involved in worship of nature deities, Buddhism, Confucianism, Taoism. Folk religious sects. Topic Notable people Ba Manzi, a legendary hero of Ba Kingdom in Zhou Dynasty. Ba Qing, the widow, the earliest known female businessman in Chinese history who provided huge financial aid to Qin Shi Huang to construct the Great Wall. Gan Ning, a general serving under warlord Sun Quan in the last years of Han Dynasty. Yan Yan, a loyal general during Three Kingdoms period. Langxi Daolong, a famous Buddhism monk and philosopher in Song Dynasty who went to Japan and established the Kencho Ji. Qin Liangyu, a popular heroine in Ming Dynasty who fought against Manchus. Ni Rongjun, Marshal of the People's Liberation Army of China Liu Bocheng, an early leader of Chinese Communist Party during Anti-Japanese War Liu Zuofu, a notable patriotic industrialist and businessman who was a member of Chinese United League and a leader of Railway Protection Movement, established the Beibei District, Chongqing Natural History Museum, Jianshan High School, the Northern Hot Spring Park of Chongqing and Beibei Library, and served as the chief official of Food Bureau during Republic of China period. Liu Yangqing, wife of the former president and party general secretary Hu Jintao. Zhang Hua Pang, a well-known calligrapher and geologist born in Sichuan but raised and lived in Chongqing. Liu Xiaoqing, an actress. Chen Kun, Chinese actor and singer. Tian Liang, Olympic diving gold medalist. Li Yundi, a pianist. Carrie Wong, a member of the pop band TF Boys and an actor Roy Wong, a singer-songwriter and member of TF Boys, also an actor and TV host Zhang Qinchen, an actress Li Hua, artist who studied in Europe Education <inaudible> 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 Topic. Colleges and universities Chongqing University Chongqing Dashui Southwest University Xinan Dashui Southwest University of Political Science and Law Xinan Zhengfa Dashui Third Military Medical University 
Disan Jun Yi Da Shui Chongqing University of Posts and Telecommunications, Chongqing Yu Dian Da Shui Chongqing University of Technology, Chongqing Li Gong Da Shui Chongqing Jiaotong University, Chongqing Jiaotong Da Shui Chongqing Medical University, Chongqing Yi Ke Da Shui Chongqing Normal University Chongqing Shi Fan Da Shui Chongqing Technology and Business University, Chongqing Gongsheng Da Shui Chongqing Three Gorges University, Chongqing San Sha Shui Yuan Chongqing Telecommunication Institute, Chongqing Tong Shuan Shui Yuan Chongqing University of Science and Technology, Chongqing KG Shui Yuan Sichuan Fine Arts Institute Sichuan Meishu Shui Yuan Sichuan International Studies University Sichuan Wai Guo Yu Da Shui University of Logistics Hu Qin Gong Sheung Shui Yuan Chongqing University of Arts and Science Chongqing Wenli Shui Yuan Yangtze Normal University Zhang Zhang Shi Fan Shui Yuan Chongqing University of Education Chongqing Di Er Shi Fan Shui Yuan Topic: Notable high schools. Fuling Experimental High School. Fuling Shi Yan Zhang Shui Chongqing Number no. One Secondary School. Chongqing Yi Zhang Chongqing Nankai Secondary School. Chongqing Nankai Zhang Shui Chongqing No. Eight Secondary School. Chongqing Ba Zhang Bashu Secondary School, Bashu Zhang Shui Chongqing Railway High School, Chongqing Tai Lu Zhang Shui Chongqing Yukai Secondary School, Yukai Zhang Shui Chongqing Foreign Language School, the high school affiliated to Sichuan International Studies University. Chongqing Yi Wai Varakan High School of Chongqing, the second Chongqing Foreign Language School. Chongqing Er Wai Chongqing Chojing High School. Chu Jing Zhang Shui High School affiliated to Southwest University. Xinan Da Shui Fu. Topic: International Schools. Yu Chung International School of Chongqing, Chongqing Yao Zhang Guo Ji Shui Shao KL International School of Chongqing Bashu, Chongqing Shi Nuo Lin Bashu Y Ji Ren Yuan Zi Nu Shui. Topic: International Relations. Topic Consulates Topic Twin Towns, Sister Cities Chongqing has sister city relationships with many cities of the world, including Toulouse, France, nineteen eighty two, Seattle, United States, nineteen eighty three. Toronto, Canada, 1986. Hiroshima, Japan, 1986. Leicester, United Kingdom, 1993. Voronezh, Russia, 1993. Zaporizhia Oblast, Ukraine, 2002. Impamalonga, South Africa, 2002. Sliven, Bulgaria, 2002. Dusseldorf, Germany, 2004. Brisbane, Australia, 2005. Shiraz, Iran, 2005. Aswan, Egypt, 2005. Busan, South Korea, 2007. Sor Trondelag, Norway, 2007. Chiang Mai Province, Thailand, 2008. Cordoba, Argentina, 2010. Pest, Hungary, 2010. Bangkok, Thailand, 2005. Antwerp, Belgium, 2011. 
Salvador, Bahia, Brazil, 2011. Detroit, United States, 2011. New York, United States, 2011. Chennai, India, 2015. Maribor, Slovenia, 2017. Teld, Spain, 2018. Topic. See also. Major national historical and cultural sites in Chongqing List of cities in China by population and built-up area List of twin towns and sister cities in China Notes <laughs> <laughs>